Hey everyone, it's Labdi and today we're going to learn how to make a square spiral in turtle blocks in Trinket.io. Okay, we all know what spirals are. I mean, we've been doing them since preschool. We've been drawing them like this or like this and so on. But today we're going to learn how to draw these spirals, in particular this square spiral in Trinket using block code. Let's head over. All right, so we're going to trinket.io slash blocks. And in this video, we're going to be learning how to make a square spiral. So in order to make a spiral, we know that we start from the middle and make small lines until our lines get bigger on the outside edge. So we will need to First, um, make a loop, obviously. Uh, let's say it repeats 10 times. Uh, that, mean, th that means that we're going to have 10 sides. And for turtle, let's put our pen down because obviously we want to draw something. Then we want the turtle to move forward 10 and turn right by an angle, which since we're making a square spiral, will be 90. Perfect. And um, let's see what this runs. Hmm. So it's just making a square, but we want it to make a square spiral. Well, we will need to add in a variable. So right now, I'm going to create a variable and call it side length. Okay, and I'm going to first set the side length to, mm, let's say, 1. Alright, and I want to set how much I move, so the side of the square, that's going to be this block over here, to this variable that I have made. So, I'm going to replace this 10 by side length and let's see what this does oh my bad so there we go all right this should work so the error that i just got was that i hadn't defined my my variable side length yet so i was using uh, a variable with no value in this block um so if we run if we if we would have ran that when it went to this block it, it didn't have a value to move forward well we changed that by setting the side length to one and let's see oh no it's hmm. what it well, what it's doing is it's just making a square with side length one well we want the side length to increase for every uh every time we repeat this 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 making the side so uh we're going to be increasing the variable so set side length not length to side length plus a value so let's say we put five numbers five oh we gotta move this here and there we go let's see what this does Hmm. Oh, I forgot to change it to 5 and okay. Perfect. So what we have right now is a basic spiral and if if I want to increase the the number of times I make this spiral, I can make this to 20 or hmm, let's see what this does. Yep, it's making a bigger spiral. So repeating the same thing 20 times instead of 10. And I can even make this 50. Let's see what that is. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to speed this up. There we go. So that took a little bit long, but we essentially got a beautiful square spiral. 
thank you uh, all of you for watching this video and hope you guys uh, see the other videos regarding spirals which are much more advanced and uh, very interesting too. Thanks, bye!